is Jammy and today I'll be showing you on how to install the Aether mod for Minecraft 1.0.0 and many people have said to me they just cannot install it just because they always get a black screen because there's six different mods you need to install but I also recommend installing too many items as well just because that makes it easier to tell if it's worked straight away or not so what you want to do you want to go down here if you have Windows 7 you just put in percent app data percent sign or you'd go into it and type run and then the same thing and then you want to access your dot minecraft folder in the bin and then open minecraft executable jar file and open it with winrar archiver or 7zip and all the links for these mods will be in the description for you people so the first thing you want to do is delete the meta inf that stops all your mods working in total so just delete that get rid of it and that you want to do you want to open up mod loader drag and drop all these in and click ok but try not to drag t two little dots there and then mod loader mp drag and drop these in and then close this and then audio mod as well just drag and drop yep ok and sapphire and then with this one people just think oh it's just drag and drop them straight in but you need to click the bin because this is your bin folder these are all class files so you highlight all of them then drag and drop them in and then this src you don't need that's just for other stuff but you don't need that so you can you'll finish with that and then this one here you drag the class files in not the text documents drag and drop them in and make sure you don't drag and drop it in over a folder otherwise you may mess your thing up and then there's too many items if you would like to install that you just drag and drop everything and now with the Aether mod you don't need actually yep yeah, you need jar you click jar and click highlight all of these files there's a lot of files so you make sure you get everyone there's a quick way but I just do it how I do it so you do that wait for that to process and then we can also um, and this is the way of doing it for Windows run oh sorry for that and then you click OK and that'll do and once that's done you can click back on this and then click and then just hover over resources and now that's done you can close out of your minecraft.jar file and then just move this over here and then go into your uh, just dot minecraft folder and then just drag and drop resources over and let's say would you like to merge this folder you just click click yes and then you can close that, close that open up your minecraft to see if it works this may take a bit of time log in and hopefully you should not get a black screen and you can see it has installed because it's the special thing you can always toggle this off but we go to single player we to quickly create a new world just to prove to you that it has worked and that you installed it properly but if you get, get any error messages or it crashes just send me a message and I will be able to help you out as much as I can and this should be done in a minute do 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 are you done yet? come on why wow, that's taking its time oh why have I dragged it down there drag that up oh let's just stop the lag quickly let's turn clouds off see oh, I guess too many items did not install but you can see the Aether mod has installed properly because there's extra things and so yeah thank you guys for watching and please comment like and subscribe for more 
um, tutorials on how to install mods and playthroughs of Minecraft. So thank you very much and I'll see you next.